you're just gonna be asking me questions. Oh. I mean, you can ask questions as well. I have three questions that I want to ask you. Okay, wait. <laughs> and you can announce the four. So, the... who wanna be asking questions about if I wanna ask you a question? Because you're not gonna say men are trash, are you? I'm not. <laughs> really exactly, not. so, okay. I'll just speak up some questions. Okay. I'm Angel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Angel. I'm Angel. Living in Oxford, I guess. I'm 18. Mm -hmm. And. Yeah, that's it, really. Yeah, she's a good friend, guys. I'm here to tell him, like. Well, I think you and the rest of your species are trash. You and... <laughs> no, I'm joking. He's not trash, You and the rest of your species. He's not trash, but like, men in general, so... Cool. Wow. Okay. Men are trash, right? Yeah. That's your conclusion? Yeah. I'm gonna ask you first, why you think men are trash? I just think that men are really deceiving. Mm -hmm. Well, to be honest, I feel like my history with... Men, they mm -hmm. haven't been like that bad, obviously. Like, I've had some good experiences, but I just think mainly Caribbeans as well. I just think that they're really deceiving, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Like, a lot of men don't have respect for women as well. Yeah. So I feel like more Africans do have respect for women, but at the same mm -hmm. time, the like, Africans seem to like, they're that. like dominant and stuff mm -hmm. over women. Mm -hmm. But I just think, like, yeah. Some some men are deceiving. Like I actually don't think all men are trash, but mm -hmm. just specific ones. When was the first time that you like concluded to yourself, you know what, men are trash? Cause <laughs> you didn't just wake up and think, oh, men are trash. The but, very first time. Uh -huh. I think like in like year ten, mm -hmm. like I found out that the guy I was speaking to was speaking to like one of my best friends as well, and I was thinking, scared of them. <laughs> <laughs> like, am I not rated? Like, I had, it was no respect involved. And then when I had a boyfriend, mm -hmm. I got cheated on after wow. like two years of being with him. It was just, and they were both Caribbean, by the way. And then. You Caribbeans. <laughs> yeah, and then I have Caribbean friends, and I just know, like, about their antics. Trash. Mm -hmm. Trash. That's when I first realized when I was like 15. Okay. Three years later, still the same opinion. <laughs> but there was the one day you put a Snapchat. Yeah. Saying that women might be worse than men. <laughs> or would you come to that conclusion? I don't even know what happened that specific day. Mm -hmm. But, mm -hmm. okay, so I do think women are actually more, I don't think they're more trash, but I think they're more evil okay. with it. Mm -hmm. So, like, if they're doing something trash, they'll make sure that they're really ruining someone's lives. Mm -hmm. Like, this comes from my friends. I think that like, my friends, you know, they're not, I'm not going to say they're trash, but, mm -hmm. you know, they know how to, like, Massive boys, <laughs> isn't it? Uh -huh. So, yeah, I just think women are more evil with it, but men do it in a way like. More consistently. Yeah. Right, yeah. Women do it for a reason. And men do it because that's just who we are, apparently. See? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's jokes. Um, I have a, I had an experience with a female, right? Mm -hmm. um, I probably told you about this already. Um, took her for dinner like a few times thinking, I right, whatever, like, just getting to know each other. Mm -hmm. And then one day I pull up at a party that I didn't want to go to, but Maurice kind of, like, pulled me. And I find out that she has a man. Ah. <laughs> she has a man. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> that was my reaction. But I wasn't in town, so it wasn't, like, that deep. But I was just, like, confused. I was like, all right, like, when someone says men are trash, I'll be like, all right, I get it. Like, it makes sense. But when it's the other way, it's kind of a, kind of a shock. Wow. <laughs> I think maybe she's just trying to keep her options open, do you know what I mean? Wow. <laughs> nah, okay, one wait. One. So, yeah, but was it like, you take a lot of girls out for dinner, right? Barely. Barely, but I'm an innocent bystander. Cut that out. Cut that out. No. no, okay. no. But you take your I friends. have a lot of friends, yes. Yeah, so he takes his female friends out for dinner. Mm. And so was it clear that like she was just a female friend or like really trying to like lotion it? Actually to be honest. Imagine though, you're a man and you have a girlfriend. Yeah. And your girlfriend is going for dinner with another man. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. If were well, you just friends, because how would you feel like as a man? Let's say your man was no, going out for dinner. Yeah, with, obviously that's not know. that's getting locked off. But exactly. like, I, that's, I felt sorry for the other guy. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> but you just said that you take your female friends out. So yeah, to be fair, if it's just a friend because the, mm -hmm. okay, yeah, that's yeah. true. Okay, okay. So, but you obviously was hurt, and I think no. I think he was hurt. So basically. <laughs> 
reason why you was hurt because it wasn't just a friendship. Mm. You were trying to lotion it, right? Mm. And maybe she was trying to lotion you. That's what I thought. Like, okay, I, well, I got energy from her side, but it's not an energy from someone who has a relationship. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, exactly. So I just think maybe, like, like I said, women do things for reasons. Mm -hmm. Maybe her man was trash on it. So, like, because he was trash, she had oh, to pay. Like payback. Yeah, like, it's, it could be payback, or she just maybe thinks, okay, I'm probably going to break up with this guy. So let me just listen. Next option. This next black guy. And. Yeah. In conclusion, women are evil. <laughs> women yeah. are evil. Alright, so let's men are trash. That's the conclusion, apparently. Um, I don't agree with that statement, but if you could create a man who's not trash, what would he be like? This is an honest guy, like. An honest guy? Yeah, like I just like, think. Like sleeps with another woman and tells you that he's like. Honest. I'm like faithful. Uh -huh. So, like, you're his everything. Mm. And, um, like, basically, I think what is trash mm -hmm. is when a guy, the most trash thing I think a guy can do is, like, lie to a woman and make mm -hmm. it seem like he wants a relationship, but he just wants sex. So I think, like, that's really trash. Mm -hmm. Like, there's no need to hurt. Because some women, like, casual yeah, sex. Like, yeah. Nah, but they like casual sex. Mm -hmm. So it's like, why are you lying just to get one thing? And it's like, that one thing you can live about. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's like... There's no need to do that. And also, to like get the woman attached to you and mm -hmm. like get into her feelings, mm -hmm. it's like, why are you like Going messing with her? Process. You don't have the right to do that. So, that's what I think is trash. And also, people like that sleep with loads of people, like, there's no need. Like, why are you bad active? <laughs> why are you actually bad active? Like, there's yeah, no need. Yeah. And then, so that's why I think. People are trash, but people in general, obviously men, just it's not just men, but mm. women can do that as well. Yeah. And I think an ideal guy who's not trash just won't do those things. Mm -hmm. So, like, if he just wants one thing, then he'll say to him, I just want this. Mm -hmm. And then if he wants a relationship, then, then he'll be, be faithful in the relationship. And he'll be clear from the start. Yeah, it's not that hard, guys. Exactly, it's not that <laughs> it's hard. It's not that hard. Um, so, so, what should happen to people who are trash? I mean, it's fascinating. <laughs> Personally, <laughs> I'd get physical because I'm just for thinking, hands. I start saying it for people. Yeah. Because I just think if you can't hear, mm. you must feel. Mm. So if you can't hear me telling you stop, I'm mm. now gonna make you feel pain <laughs> and go automatically stop. That's what I think should happen. But obviously, a lot of people have different opinions. Yeah, like. In their defense, in our defense, because it's one for one and all for one, um, <laughs> what if that's like all they've ever known? They've never experienced anything different. Okay, well, you know what I'm saying? Is that? Da, 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 da. You can't just. Do you reckon if a woman was clear about what she wants from the relationship from the beginning, she could avoid that? Does that make sense? No. Because some men just think, okay, but I can still get like. I can still get um, sex from her, like, either way, like. Mm -hmm. And it's just like. <laughs> she just told you she doesn't want just sex. She yeah. just told you she wants a relationship, and you're still Some don't messing know. around. Some women will not tell. Some women, what they want. Okay, that's just that's their own, isn't it? Some people are just done with it, and she deserve to get what you get. But if a woman is generally kind-hearted and she's opening up herself to you, like mm -hmm. that's just cool. Like, why are you doing that? <laughs> Technically, both sexes have to do better in a sense. Um, there was the other female who took one of my friends out. And she, she told him that she just wanted to practice for a day. And can Goku avenge the life of his close friend, Krillin? The only way to find out is to stay tuned to the next exciting episode of Dragon Ball Z.